but before this challenge that's coming up this morning, I kind of feel a little bit fresher. I'm sure that Jess has all the good advice. We started with Pauline doing five or so laps just to know where we were as a baseline. She took me through everything out there, where to break, where to go faster. On the brakes, get it in, into the apex. It was just amazing, I just loved it. So much room for improvement. Your lines were really, really good, really good. So that was a 84, that was a good effort. Racing line and braking are the two most important things. Enter all the way on the left-hand side. We then, as we go into the corner, be tightening up to the apex of the corner. You have to be scientific in golf with the technical accuracy of the entire swing. And when you're on a circuit, the line that you have to take to take the curve and stuff like that. Right, so this next lap is gonna be your last lap. So I wanna see some purple sectors. I think the skills I used from golf was the breathing part because I was trying to loosen myself up a little bit more. Go like this. That's it. Back on the power, go. On the brakes, keep it over to the left. Don't turn too early. Got it. Keep it going. Come on! You did an 80.5, so you found four seconds. That's pretty good. From beginning to the end, I saw a huge improvement. So, um, and that's what we're looking for. I was really like pushing the limit and it felt really good. Um, and kind of scary, but that was fun. Now it's uh, it's my turn to show you some tricks. Let's go golfing. Cool, let's go. Jess, we're on the 18th hole at Centurion Club. You know what, we're gonna play it, improve your game a little bit. Okay. Okay. Yeah. I took Jess to hit a couple of balls, you know, get the feel of the club and see where she was at and what she could improve. A bit more left, the other left. I think he, I'm might, not looking. Go, I think he might go splash. Oh, I look cool though. <laughs> and then from there, I took Jess on the range, you know, get the feel of the club. The important things to focus on is the stance, the ball position in the fit, and the grip. That's the angles. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I had a few air shots, which is a little embarrassing. You just went up a little too early. Okay. Um, try to keep your head on the ball, your eyes on the ball. Keep those hips angles with your upper body. That's pretty good. Based on the couple of tips I gave her, we went out there on the 18th hole and tried to play it. I just said to myself, right Jess, it's a quality lap and uh, then I hit my best shot. In any sport, you have to be strong, not only physically, but mentally as well. That was the best one. <laughs> really good impact. I guess it's all about getting yourself in the right headspace and, and focusing and not putting too much pressure on yourself either. There you go. Being around the green is actually one of the hardest part of golf. Almost. You need so much precision and being delicate with the club and she managed that really, really well. Woo! Let's go! She's a natural, honestly. It was great to watch. Smashed it. I do think I improved a lot over the day, so um, yeah, I'm happy. Across all sports, there are parallels and similarities. Accuracy, focus, precision, it makes the difference between good players and great players. All pro athletes push the limits of what's possible.